taste test. Welcome to Taste Test Tuesday. Woo! I forgot to put on my ring. You wait, my ring? You guys are gonna die. YOLO! <laughs> Welcome to Taste Test Tuesday, everyone. Let's get started. If you haven't tried something new today, try something new. Maybe run to Skidoo. No, don't run to Skidoo. That could be dangerous. <laughs> All the Skidoo enthusiasts. <laughs> Dislike. I don't know, watch Scooby-Doo. Don't rent a Scooby-Doo, watch Scooby-Doo. I'm trying to be a rapper. I have a bunch of different holiday themed snacks. If you don't celebrate Christmas, happy whatever you celebrate, or just happy day. Hello, happy day. Like my ears. Woo! I know that you can see like through here a little bit, but you know what? I really liked this background. I thought it went with like the vibe and the aesthetic and like the little lights and the flashing. So just, yeah, that's my laundry door. So the laundry door is like here making an appearance. <laughs> Say hello to the door. Here's the Christmas makeup. And I'm really excited to try some snacks with you guys. This is everything I got, let's go. Okay, so the first thing I already know I'm not gonna like, but <laughs> Austin suggested I try it. They are candy cane mini eggs. He is obsessed with mini eggs, like all year round. Like he just loves them so much. He has a stockpile of them. He like literally, like you touch his mini eggs and he's like, ah. <laughs> I don't know, I don't like candy cane flavored things, but you know what? With crunchy candy cane pieces inside. Candy cane, okay. Let's do it. I like mini eggs though, but. Candy cane, candy cane. What the hell? Here we go already, me not being able to open anything. Oh, there's a slit in it. Oh yeah, baby. <sighs> yeah, they smell like candy cane. Oh, the colors are just like whack. They're not holiday at all, what? I thought they would be like red and white or green. They're just like all pale. Like they're all pale. They're like me before a spray tan. Like, okay. Like, they're so boring. Okay, I'm gonna try the only colored one, green. Look at the rest. Oops, <laughs> I, I laid an egg. <laughs> I laid an egg. I hope there's like candy cane pieces inside. With crunchy candy cane pieces inside. My nails versus my teeth versus my lip gloss. It's gonna be hard. Okay, so there's kind of candy cane pieces inside. You know what? <laughs> They're not too candy cane-y. I actually like these bad boys. I hate that sentence and I can't believe I just used it, but okay. I can get done with these. I just realized I didn't use my good lens camera. I'm so sorry. Mmm, I like these. I give them like a solid like 7.8 out of 10. Next, we are gonna try some Frank turkey stuffing chips. So Frank is a Canadian tire brand. I'm pretty sure it's only sold at Canadian Tire, so if you don't know what that is. Also, Frank is always doing like crazy stuff. Right now he has uh, a knife and fork. He is a turkey and it says, Frank feels stuffed. <laughs> Me. Turkey stuffing flavored potato chips. I know like it's like Thanksgiving Eve, but I feel like everyone has turkey on Thanksgiving too. Christmas too, right? So let's. It does smell like a turkey. It actually smells like a rotisserie chicken, which has been like my obsession lately. Oh, here you go. This is what they look like. A ripple too. Ooh, ooh, they look like nice and coated. They look like like stuffing. You know what I mean? All the herbs and stuff and stuffing. Let's see. Crunch test. Mmm. They really do taste like stuffing. Crunchy stuffing. And somehow they incorporated gravy in there and I'm like, Oh my god, these are addicting. Oh, uh -huh. okay, next. Mm, I think I'm really not gonna like these, but these are Warhead um, Ooze Chews Ropes. There is Merry Cherry and Jolly Apple. There's a Christmas tree there with lights on it, which I feel like is a fire hazard if you put light bulb or candle sticks or whatever. Sour chewy candy filled with ooze. Okay, let's do it. Okay, ready? Oh my god. Ooh, mm. Smells like kids' toothpaste. Repulsive. <laughs> I'm gonna try them both. Let's do the Jolly Apple first. It's not too oozy. I'm gonna break my jaw. It's not even sour. Aren't like warheads like, the guy's face is like, it's like me after getting lip injections. Like it's actually not that bad, but it's not sour. It's not oozy. False advertising I feel. Let's try the Mary Cherry. Um, mm -hmm. This one smells better. I think it's just the bag in general. <laughs> I don't know how it could be the bag, but whatever. 
I'm not really a candy person. These are kind of addicting. They're not as chewy as like Starburst. Ooh, this one is a little sour, but like a little sour. I like live wires. So these are like live wires, but they're not oozy. I like these. I think I'm gonna get them, give them like an eight out of 10. Next we have some cookie pop. This is gin ice gingerbread cookie pop. $7 for this. What do you think of the price? Let me know. I love the festive bag. Love gingerbread. At last, Canada. Two of your favorite snacks joined together. Why does it say at last? Ask Canada. I'm like, oh, Canada. Oh, that smells like exactly like that one Bath and Body Works candle that's gingerbread, like iced gingerbread or something like that. Oh my God. Whenever people say like, oh, I wish I could eat this candle. I am now doing that right now. Like, the, oh wait, you guys always like to know what it looks like. That's what it looks like. It really looks like nothing, but hopefully the flavor and taste because gingerbread is my fave. I'm disappointed. <laughs> There's like really no coating on it. I know you guys can even see that. I just was expecting like a punch, like packing a punch. Oh, that one was a little bit more. I'm really just tasting icing and like cinnamon. It's not really giving gingerbread. It's kind of stale. I'm sad. Six out of 10. I am most excited about this. Hello Kitty. Okay, so I know that there's like hot chocolate bombs. So that's what I immediately thought when I saw this, but it doesn't say that on there. It looked at the packaging also. So cute. Happy holidays on the back there. It doesn't say to put it in hot chocolate. I know you probably could. And then you would get that little marshmallow in there. Cause it just says milk chocolate with marshmallow. So I think it's one of those like where you like crack it open and then eat it. Honestly, it's candy. You could do either way. It doesn't matter. You're not eating something wrong, right? If I put in hot chocolate or if I just ate the chocolate, I think either way would be good. She is holding a cup of hot cocoa though or hot chocolate. I can't wait to try this. This was $11. So it better be worth it, Hello Kitty. Normally when I, when I had my Hello Kitty collection, I would never have opened this. <laughs> Girly, what the hell? She's like, I live here. Don't disrupt my heart. Oh, it's like taped in. Like I'm talking taped in. <laughs> okay, cut her free. <laughs> oh my God, it's so cute. It's so cute for Christmas. This, oh, smells so good. It smells like chocolate. <laughs> it smells like that like, Whenever I say like fake chocolate, I mean like dollar store chocolate, like cheap chocolate. Like I love that smell. But I actually think this is a bomb. Oh no, not like a chocolate bomb. Ready, 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 what's inside? It just better be her like sleeping upside down. She better have a face. Please have a face. She's stuck in there. This is a hot chocolate bomb for sure. No, that is her face. That's her face. It's just, yep. You see, she's got the little eyes and nose. This is definitely a hot chocolate bomb. But we're here for it, whatever. Eat food how you want. Put it in a salad. Like, who cares? Mm. Very like Kinder Surprise egg. Now let's try her. She feels hard. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, she's hard. Oh, I... Am I... oh, I thought I snapped off a tooth that literally sounded like a tooth snappy. Mm -mm. Nope, girly. Girly pop, two out of 10. <laughs> Also, not worth $11. Unless you're making a little kid's day and you want her to like come out of the hot chocolate, then it's like a nine out of 10, but nope. Okay, kind of disappointing. <laughs> Let's try something that Austin actually picked up for me. He's like, these are, um, I don't even, uh, German Christmas, German, German, <laughs> German Christmas cookies. I am not even going to attempt how to pronounce the name, but uh, it looks like this. I do not know. Should I try? Weeb Plefernice Mint Chocolobian Undicar. <laughs> I feel like I'm in Harry Potter and I just cast a spell. I don't know how to pronounce that. They're glazed Pluffernoose cookies. They're glazed these cookies. They look delicious. They look like little zebras. Let's give it a go. I'm excited about these. Ooh, ooh, not a, what I was expecting it to smell like. It smells like a Jaeger bomb. So like black licorice. Ooh, it smells like minty, like black licorice mint, like slightly alcohol. I don't know, they look like this. They are so cute. Oh, they're so like light and airy. Like what? These are so interesting, I'm excited. I really have no idea what to expect in the middle, but let's bite it. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God, yum. It's like gingerbread licorice. This is gingerbread. Oh my God. I feel like this is like licorice -y. Oh my God, it's so soft in the middle. This is like so a soft gingerbread cookie with icing on it. 
Oh my god, best thing, hands down, that I've tried so far. Thank you to Germany. Sorry for the butchering of the pronunciation. 8.8 .8 out of 10. Like, bye, I'm eating these whole, this whole thing. Next, something I'm not gonna like. This is Bailey's um, chocolates. Ugh, I don't like Bailey's. Three pieces, let's try them. I've probably tried these in the past, but I don't remember. I don't like alcohol-filled chocolates. Also, I don't know, do these contain alcohol? I don't know, oh, cute. Okay, the packaging, oh my god, there's like a little tray. It's like, ooh, here's one. Ooh. My uncle, I would give him um, alcohol-filled chocolates every year and he'd be so excited. <laughs> Just reminds me of him. Oh, oh, for it. It's like it really just tastes like a shot of like Hennessy or something like that. Like eh. this is what it looks like inside. It looks delicious, but it's just so alcoholy that it's just like, ugh. And I don't know how they can sell these in grocery stores because like I know it's like the slightest bit of alcohol, but still, like I'm always like, ew. Eh, that's gross. Like 0 0.3 out of 10. I just don't personally just don't like it. Austin got these for me. These are Reese's Holiday Lights, and it's pronounced. Reese's, not Reese's. Watch any commercial. They say that's of their brand. Their brand. They say their brand and they say Reese's. But <laughs> holiday lights. They just look like eggs, bestie. I love Reese's though. <laughs> this is not going well. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. There's more chocolate in this than like your regular like peanut butter cup. So ooh. These are good. Yep, I'm gonna eat the whole pack of these. <laughs> okay, now we have a kinder little gingerbread guy, which is so cute. This is what it looks like. Let's see what's inside. My battery's about to die on this camera, so it'll suddenly shut off, but I'll suddenly be back. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I hate when you open it and it just gets like, <laughs> like just sad. He's like a naked little guy. Now, is there a present inside? Do I crack it? What do I do? I'm just gonna do a big bite. Okay. It just died, but um, I half bit it. Perfect timing, right? Okay, round two. Okay. Way too much to have in my mouth at once. Mmm. Mm. I love a good Kinder Egg. Mm -hmm. Wait, so there's no toy? It's just chocolate? Well, I guess it's not a Kinder surprise. Am I stupid? This was also $5. So, Kinder, here you go. Free promotion. Get that bag, sis. $5. I am so excited about this one. This one is a German. Kinder surprise. Here, I'll show you like the little setup here. The guy um, at the store selling these, he's like, we got these from Germany. They're Kinder surprise from Germany. So this is super exciting for me. I'm not even gonna pronounce that, but let's get into it. And I usually have to like read the instructions like eight times for the Kinder surprises because sometimes you have to put them together. So if they're all in German, I'm gonna be like, what do I do? I'm gonna be like, a schlibbenich. That's the only thing I know how to say in German, which is, I love you. So I'll just be like, I love you. <laughs> Oh, very soft. Oh, it's so peeling just to crack it. Oh, let's see if it tastes different than a regular Kinder. Like, I shouldn't say regular. I mean, like, like a Canadian or, oh, I was gonna say American, but I think, wait, in America, do you guys have Kinder? Because I know Kinder surprises are banned, but do you guys still have Kinder? Let me know. Mm, chocolate is still the same. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay, let's see the toy. Oh my, oh my God. Oh no, you have to build it. Oh no. <gasps> Okay, wait, I want to see the instructions. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, it's just like pictures, right? Looks like this. So we're making the little reindeer. I think I can do it. I think I got this, you guys. Okay, number one, get his feet. <laughs> got him. Oh, I was like, what? Why is his back leg like that? Like what? Because he has one, two, three. Why is his leg like this? Like, is it broken? Like, does he need to go to the ER or something like that? But no, he's like kicking. He's skating. Okay, number two, slam him down on here. Oh God. <gasps> we did it. I did it. Period. Artist. Number three. What? Oh my god, I was supposed to put his head on first. <laughs> I can do this right now, right? Like, will it matter? No. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. See, that's why. That's why it said to put his head on first. <sighs> what is going on here? He doesn't fit now. How doesn't he fit? Oh my god. Hello there. And he's not Rudolph. He doesn't have a red nose. So we're going to call him Vixen. Or her. You know, and then what's the, th what is the third thing? I don't get what the third thing is. It says, oh my God, he just fell off. He's gone, he's gone. Oh my God. Okay, so step number three says to like pull this and then he'll spin, but um, I don't have that red thing. The red thing isn't included anywhere in here. Um, But I can see that he's very unstable, like me. I don't know, like does he just, does he spin? What is this? See, he's so unstable. There we go. 
Okay, so the very last thing are these lint teddies, which are so cute. They look like this. I love lint chocolate. This chef's kiss. One already fell, so we're gonna try this guy right here. Why is so many things going wrong right now? Cute. I think it's just gonna be solid chocolate, but see when I smell this, it smells very much like, like high-end chocolate. Like it's so good. It's filled. It's filled with cream. Oh my god. Yeah. Nine out of ten. Out of this world. Mm hmm Well, I am chocolate drunk right now. <laughs> or what is it? Chocolate wasted. I want to get chocolate wasted. That's literally me right now. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this holiday taste test. I love you guys so, so much. I hope you guys have a beautiful holiday. If you're in school, a holiday break. If you don't celebrate, just a good day. If you celebrate something else, whatever it is. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, happy everything else. <laughs> I love you guys. Love from Pink Sparkles. Bye. Mwah.